Before we start this video, join my channel membership and gain access to all my premium courses. To add tracking subtitle in DaVinci Resolve, first I am going to drag this clip in timeline. Now go to the VN page. Now I am going to press shift plus space and I am going to search for tracker. Press shift hold it and we have to drag this in between these two nodes. Now I am going to drag this window and I am going to drag this person A dot right here. Now we can place this window about here. Now we have to click on this button in order to drag forward. Now I am going to press this stop button. Click on the yes button. Now I am going to trim my video so I am going to drag this yellow to the tracking point. Right. So now we have this tracking data. Now guys the next step is I am going to drag this text and I am going to drop this about here. Now I am going to connect this to my tracker. Now we have to select this one. I am going to press 1 on the keyboard. And now as you can see guys now we have this text window on the left side. Now I am going to type a text so so I type hi whatsapp. Now as you can see guys this text is not shown on the screen because we have to go to the tracker. We have to go to the operation and now we have to select match make in the operation. And now as you can see guys now we have this text. Now we have to select the text and now I am going to place this about here. And I am going to lower the size and let's place this about here. Now if I play this video as you can see guys now we have this text tracked to this data. But the text is shaking. So we have to go to the tracker and right here as you can see guys we have to only track the position. We don't need to track rotation and scaling. And now if I play this video as you can see guys now we have this text. Now we can select this one and I am going to show this text show the subtitle from 0 frame to 29 frame. So I am going to type 0 to 29. And now if I go to the 30th frame, the text will disappear. So this way we can add tracking subtitle. Now if you want to animate your subtitle, I am going to select this one. I am going to right click and I am going to select follower. Now we have to go to the modifier. I am going to add a 0.8 delay. Now go to the transform. Now in transform we can animate the rotation. So as you can see again nothing is happening right. So we have to add a keyframe first. And now we can animate this. Now let's go to the 15th frame of this video. And now we can place this to about here. And now if I play this as you can see guys. This subtitle will appear like this. Now we can select the tracker. We can go to the settings. Go to the tool if you are in modifier. And now we can enable motion blur. Now I'm going to select this. I'm going to right click and I'm going to create a group. I'm going to press Ctrl C and V to duplicate this group. Double click to open this group. Select this one. Go to the text, double click here and I am going to type my name is. Now we have to change the frame as well. So I am going to change this to 30 and let's change this to 60. And now if I play this video, so click here. As you can see guys, now we have this first subtitle. We have the second subtitle. So we have to select this subtitle, right? We have to click here. We have to right click and I am going to select this time character level styling, right? Now I am going to select this one text, press 1 on the keyboard. We can zoom in using the control, hold it and the scroll. I'm going to select the name, go to the modifier and I'm going to change the color of this name only. Now let's click OK. Now I'm going to also change this to bold, right? I'm going to select this one and let's change this to semi-bold. Select this and change the color to white. Now duplicate this, double click, select this one, press 1 on the keyboard. Double click here, change the frame to 61 and to 90. And now if we go to the 61 frame, as you can see guys, now we have this name. So I'm going to select my name, go to the modifier and I'm going to change my color to this one. Now if we go to the edit page, we can zoom in. Let's change the playback to quarter. And now if I play this video, as you can see guys, now we have this tracking subtitle. So this is how we can add tracking subtitle in DaVinci Resolve.